it's October, the days are getting cooler, and it's time to let go of my summer wardrobe of skirts and dresses and switch to my jeans and slacks. Ta-da! Hi, I'm Agnes. Welcome to my eclectic channel. Uh, I make videos for fun and what I just showed you really is the extent of what I own in terms of pants. I like my comfort, so most of what I wear are dresses and skirts, even through the winter time. And I live in a place where winters are uh, to be reckoned with. <laughs> and I grew up somewhere where winters were to be reckoned with. Um, I guess nowadays it's not common for uh, people to uh, like wear anything else than pants in the winter time. It's, it's gotten like, I don't know where we get that idea that that was the only way to stay warm. Uh, actually, it's not, and it is not even the best way to stay warm in, in, in my experience. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to be talking about um, wearing skirts and dresses in the winter time. Let's start with uh, what the French call la mi-saison, this time of the year, the mid-season, <laughs> this time of the year when we're switching from warm days to the cold days. Uh, and it's a really, it's, it's, a, it's a tough time of year because <laughs> in a single day you can experience winter and, and summer all at once. In that time of year, I like to use leg warmers, uh, just like mittens or a scarf. There are accessories that you can put on in the morning when you need them and easily take off when the day gets warmer. And when the season gets further along, uh, leg warmers really do become part of uh, my uh, uh, all of the winter accessories. Um, I keep in my in my winter clothes in my coat closet uh, a, a small cabinet where I put uh, my winter hats my gloves, the scarves, and my leg warmers. Uh, so, so, so something that uh, leg warmers can do um, is to turn a, a pair of low boots into higher boots if you need this extra warmth, but you don't have uh, uh, roomy uh, boots. Uh, and then moving along in, in the season, uh, I am going to say an awful word sweater tights yeah the sweater tights you know the ones that schoolgirls wear <laughs> the ones that your mom wore when she was a child uh, or, or a young woman uh they they are harder to find uh, i happen to re be really tiny so i i buy winter tights and they still uh have them for little girls maybe that's part of uh, girls uniform i'm not sure i'm just thrilled to find them I also go online and I, I have some that I bought 20 years ago <laughs> that are still good and that, that I'm still wearing. Uh, they're completely timeless. They're functional. Uh, and uh, the, the reason I like sweater tights uh, is because they, they're, you can layer them. Uh, and also, it's a similar reason to why I like dresses. They're no brainers. If you wear, you, you can wear leggings, um, but then you, you're gonna have to worry about the feet. And then you have to pair the leggings with socks. And now you have a transition from the socks to the leggings and sometimes in boots, that's uncomfortable. I'm sensitive, so for me, sometimes that's uncomfortable. The, 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 with the sweater tights are just one, it's just one unit. So you can even wear winter tights in, in, uh, with shoes or low boots. So you don't need to worry about this transition and, and either showing it off the right way or, or hiding it. Uh, it. It's just really easy. And then, <laughs> this is where it gets even better. So uh, where I live, it gets really cold in the winter time. So my winter tights being um, seamless, can be layered <laughs> under thermals, leggings, whatever else I need under my long skirts and in my boots to stay warm. I should also mention that, and, and this should be obvious, the skirts 
and dresses that I wear in the winter time are not the same as I wear in the summertime. I have a whole spectrum to, to adapt to uh, the progression of the season. Uh, and w when it gets to just full winter, I mean, they have to be wool uh, and often longer. The skirt becomes an important part of the insulation. Uh, the skirt combined with, uh, with boots. And if, if you think about it, like not just think I've experimented, um, I don't find pants particularly warm. Uh, perhaps people put legwear underneath, um, but then you have less room. So I really don't know. And, and, and when I see women wearing leggings and leggings without anything over the, those leggings, I use leggings as a part of, of, uh, of my system to stay warm. Uh, but skinny jeans, I, I don't, you can't, I don't know if you can layer anything under skinny jeans. So I really wonder about how warm that, that is keeping people. Um, but if you're wearing a, a long skirt, ooh, you can, there's a lot you can put under there and you have a, a nice bubble of, of air. It's really, really well insulating. So there you have it, an unconventional way of uh, staying warm in the, in the winter time. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please give it a like.